Today, we're going to use uh, a fictitious HR for our company, no affiliation with Zoom or any of our customers, of course, and we're going to see if we can get some general answers. And by doing that, we're going to go down into our AI studio, and then we're going to look into the knowledge base. I did want to point out that we have, um, here we're going to have three very specific days that are here as far as HR payroll and commission calendar, policies, and FAQ. And then under virtual agents, we're going to go ahead and start building a virtual agent for voice. So to do that, we're going to make Hannah HR. So for the agent guidance, we're going to go ahead and grab Hannah here. And while I usually like to put puns and things inside of here, uh, vacation days are no laughing matter. So we're going to go ahead and grab this from here. And let's get Hannah's greeting. Uh, so here, paste. Hannah, your HR helper. You can ask me about time off payroll on most any vacation time question. How can I help you? So what's unique about this is today we're going to ask very generalized questions. But what I wanted to point out here is you have the ability with Zoom's virtual agents in order to leverage some of these just general sources as well as some skills and tools in order to create deeper questions. Usually I know when I'm asking HR, I want to know what my commission date is going to be or my vacation day bank that I have left. So when I'm asking general questions, which you'll be able to see today, we can do that. If you want to ask specific questions as according to your actual specific employees, this is where you would use skills and tools. We could also use these to do things like validate a specific user. So in the tools, we have uh, built-in tools, which are surveys, one-time passwords. And we also have custom tools, which are looking up customers, order status, ticket lookup, etc. You can actually create a custom tool, which can then do a data dip into any kind of database to get the specific information someone wants. In order to do that, you're going to need to set up a demo with one of my friends at Zoom. So, but today we'll show you some real quick building an agent and uh, they can show you that more customized place. Obviously we have a marketplace where we can go into and look at some custom built-ins, but let's go back over to our virtual agents and we're just gonna go ahead and create Hannah real quick. And we're going to ask Hannah some questions about just general things in HR. Now, I did want to make sure that I pulled up our standard vacation policy that's here. Uh, you can see that this is just something that was generated, right? Uh, I am gonna ask about uh, donation of vacation days, cashing out, and of course, how many vacation days I have left. So we'll be able to pull that up and make sure to show that during the conversation. So let's talk to Hannah. Hi, I'm Hannah, your HR helper. You can ask me about time off, payroll, or most any vacation time question. How can I help you? Hey Hannah, I was wondering to see how many vacation days do I get this year? Certainly, I'd be happy to help you find out about your vacation days. Let me look that up for you right away. The number of vacation days you get depends on how long you've been with the company. It ranges from 15 to 30 days per year. How long have you been working here? Um, I've been with the company about six years. Great. Thanks for letting me know. With six years of service, you're entitled to 25 vacation days this year. That sounds awesome, Hannah. Thank you very much. I actually want to give some of those to my friend Jordan. Um, he just he looks like he needs a break. So uh, can I donate some of those to him? I appreciate your generosity, but unfortunately, vacation days can't be transferred between employees. Is there another way I can help you or Jordan? Yeah, actually, I want to I... donate them to him. You sure I can't donate those? You're right to double check. I apologize for the confusion earlier. You can actually donate up to five vacation days to coworkers facing catastrophic events. Is Jordan in such a situation? 
Well, that's none of my business right now. I just think he looks tired. But the last thing that I was going to ask is I am interested. When is my commission getting paid out in October of this year? Please. I understand. Regarding your commission payout in October, let me check that information for you right away. Great news. Your October commission will be paid out on Friday, October 31st, 2025. That's the last Friday of the month. Well, I also want to ask too, how do you make a banana sandwich? I apologize, but I can't provide recipes or cooking advice. Is there anything related to HR or your employment that I can assist you with? Yeah, do you provide any skydiving benefits? I apologize, but our company doesn't offer skydiving benefits. Is there a specific work-related benefit you're interested in learning about? Yeah, let me talk to an agent and uh, I'll ask him about the skydiving benefits. Thanks. Certainly, I'll transfer you to a human agent now. Please hold on. So you saw there where the agent was actually showing donation, and I think what it was doing was actually looking for specific donation that I had available, not just the general rules, which it did go back and get corrected on itself. Now, if we were to have a database connected to here, obviously you can see your knowledge base, but that would be connected through your skills that you have, as well as any kind of actual channels where you'd like to leverage this. And channels could be any of the modalities offered within Contact Center. Makes it very easy to go from a virtual agent that can handle your triage all the way through to making sure your employees are being taken care of.